what is going on lunatics i'm going to tell you why the market is dipped right now i'm going to tell you why luna classic is going to rip tomorrow and uh hopefully we can put this up in a nice little bow and get you guys on your way first of all if you like this type of content make sure you hit the like button subscribe button bell to be notified of future content let's go all right first the reason that we're dipping in the overall and broader market is because of this number right here uh 65 million dollars in outflows first time in 19 days that the bitcoin etfs have had outflows how does that affect the broader market well uh when it's good then price go up when it's red price go down so that's all and it'll reverse pretty soon we're about to get the information from the fomc uh chairman jerome powell should have his uh conference call and, and well he's got the conference call today the meeting i think is um uh, i think the announcement will be on wednesday so uh we should see some real significant price action coming very very soon today is june the 11th june the 12th that's when we go into court and when judge rakoff decides about the penalties uh in the settlement between terraform labs and the sec now at this point we don't have a lot of information about that we're waiting for the filing the filing will give us some clarity about that but we also have 256 million lunk just sent over to genuine labs that's thirty thousand dollars in order to support uh, their new initiative and their approvals here uh, the upgrade of core sdk 47 prevent peer to fear storms and update the relevant dependencies um, that's kind of a, a payment if you will for uh, work done so uh, hopefully we're not giving out too much and by the way not worried about genuine labs um, then we have the delegator plus validator support this is up if you guys want to come over and check this out um, uh, if you want to, if you want to, um, it's on the Commonwealth. This is uh, the Terra Classic website. Efforts are being made to create a website. You learn a lot. You don't have to agree with everyone. However, I still ask you to remember that an attempt to implement it should be made. Uh, I as a member and you as a member of the, in the form of a delegate or a validator, ask you to provide or grant this project appropriate support or opportunity, uh, which they should. Uh, I think uh, all nodes basically said, no, we don't care. But everybody should care that there is a website because people need to be able to come somewhere in order for a community to grow. They need to know there are some people who are going to perform their own due diligence. They're not just going to ape in uh, like a degen. If you want somebody to come into your ecosystem, you have to provide them with information on that ecosystem uh, and not look at them and go, hey, figure it out, bro. So uh, having this even an unofficial Terra Classic website is a good start. Uh, even if it's in control of somebody who you may not like or something like that. It has to be done if you want to grow. If you want a thriving community, there are certain tenets and certain processes that matter. And right now, we don't have the most basic. You can't go to a website and figure out what's going on with Terra Classic. So uh, I think that it's an important thing. Now, price action. Price action, as you can see right here, uh, we're still kind of moving along this. Uh, you know, I told you guys yesterday that this line was going to represent, you know, a, a, a point of uh, bounce and so far it started to bounce you can see we got the wick down just a little bit and then it immediately got bought back up into this range now uh, I put this yellow line down here because there is a possibility that this market continues to break down even further uh, from this negative day where we're, we're down about 90 billion when I started this down 77 billion at this point so you know a little wonky how the market's going but this bounce right here could be in the cards coming up next and it could be that we we experience that and then of course this is going to cause uh, a little fight there a little fight there a little fight there before we get that breakout it might take a little bit longer uh, the market looks like it wants to come down quite a bit um, and it has so far but I don't know if it's going to stay that way of course there's going to be a reversal long term very bullish we still maintain bullish but again like I, I there is some possibility here that this dips down a, a bit more so um, I'll, I'll keep watching I'll let you know uh, as far as uh, these go uh, we're down about 10 percent on rack off today uh, lunk down about four cents um, you know overall market just just really a, a day of red so I uh, think nothing of it until further notice station no proposals the uh, uh, the the spending proposal of course went through yesterday uh, so there's nothing out there that needs to be voted on or anything like that uh burn tracker 250 million again declining volume it's it's this right here 23 million uh it's up a little bit on the day but but even at 23 million it's not a lot it's it's just uh, uh um it, that's a concern 10 million in volume on ustc again just a concern we, we want to see more volume we want to see more uh we want to see more pump and uh, we're not really there right now so uh but that leads us to the token of the day that we're going to talk about and that's going to be uh tutan kamun 
Uh, I think that's, uh, it's basically Tutankhamun, who was an Egyptian prince. And if you are interested to come check this out, it's a new startup. Uh, just kind of came out here. Uh, they're using the old profile pic. It came up with this as an idea, Tutankhamun. If you want to, uh, you can check it out at any time on Coin Hall. Um, TKMN on Terra Classic right here, up 12.5% on the day. You can see it's just kind of having a nice little move here. Uh, uh, 30,000 market cap, by the way. Liquidity, 20,000. Uh, they're, they're looking to kind of get a rip here to a penny at least. Be about 9x from where it is right now. 8x, sorry. But uh, Tutankhamen, uh, I, I would certainly go check this out. Um, you got nine days before the contest is over. Cryptonomy.finance is giving away 100,000 USD worth of of Pepe. Not only that, we've got a mobile app coming very, very soon. Uh, we're also launching a public partnership with a strong team. Uh, it's going to result in one of the best exchanges on the market. Also, you're going to get some unique marketing information from Cryptonomy if you sign up today, and you'll get some trading opportunities for free. Cryptonomy.finance giving away $100,000 worth of USD. Pepe. This is going to take you through a 100 billion. I think Pepe is going to be the first 100 billion uh, crypto in meme coins. So don't miss out on this opportunity. Sign up today. Helps me out tremendously. Cryptonomy.finance. Don't forget it. Website. I was created on the Terraport decks to support the Terra Classic chain and offer unique experience to investors. Um, I, you know, do your own research. Decide if this is something that you're you're interested in the uh there's the supply the reduction uh 0.025 of the tax uh revenues obtained as lunk burns so uh again another something to to burn here's the white paper right here so if you're interested you can come over here and check this out uh, there's a, a whole bunch of 100 million tokens provided a limited supply uh, liquidity pool is 20 million tokens uh, marketing development is 20 million development team is 20 million startup is 20 million and future burn liquidity providers 20 million so uh, you can see basically 80 million is going to be the circulating supply because if you have 20 million for burn, then, you know, 80 million is it. And there's a 1% transaction tax uh, and 0.25% of that is going towards burning. So here we go. Point, uh, 25 of the transaction tax will be burned permanently, uh, creating a deflationary effect on the token supply. And then 25% of that will be burned as Luna Classic to support. Uh, wish it would have had some USTC in it, but... It is what it is. Uh, so if you're interested, you certainly should go check that out. Uh, Tutankhamun, um, you know, one of the most famous Egyptian princes. Um, and uh, that's it. I think we wrapped this up in a nice little bow and did it pretty quick. So market's dipping because of Bitcoin, um, having an outflows for the day. The overall market, um, you know, probably in need of a dip. How far down do we go? I would say 63,000 on Bitcoin, maybe. Uh, maybe, maybe not. You know, we might get a, a, a nice little reversal at any point. This market is uh, very wonky. So at any moment, it can just reverse and start to absolutely rip. So let me know what you think. Comment section down below. Remember, it's not financial advice. I'm always right.